wanna know what it is quick as trying to say. Good morning, guys. We are starting our trip to South Lake Tahoe. It is 4.23 in the morning. We were supposed to leave at 4 o'clock, but we're a little late, and that's completely fine. Our first stop to go supercharged will be in Beatty, Nevada. Betty, Nevada, I don't know how you pronounce it. And we're expected to be there in 8 hours and 6 minutes, but we will arrive at the first supercharger at 6.04. I'll pretty much catch up with y'all once we get to the first supercharger, and I'll let y'all know how the trip is going then. I just wanted to let y'all know how autopilot in a Tesla Model 3 standard range plus works. So, right now I'm going the exact speed limit because that's recommended in order for you to make your range amount to your supercharger destination that you plugged in for the trip. This is a one kilogram weight and this is a phone holder. The combo is perfect. If I didn't have this device, I'd get constant notifications, maybe every five to 10 seconds, letting me know that I need to put my hand on the wheel or apply slight pressure to the wheel. My hands are completely off the wheel and my feet are not on the pedals. The only thing I have to do is turn off autopilot in order to switch lanes and to stop if we reach a stop light but we're on a, a highway so we won't have any stoplights so pretty much for the next 91 miles i'm cruising like this hands free feet free so far so good when it comes to road tripping in a tesla model 3 standard range plus again make sure you travel the recommended amount pretty much the speed limit or maybe five over to ensure that you don't go over the range amount until you reach your next destination so we reached Betty, Nevada, and we are supercharging right now. It's estimated that we'd only need to charge for 20 minutes, and luckily 20 minutes isn't that long. And we'll be headed towards Hawthorne, and that's gonna be our next supercharger. We'll be there in a little under two hours. We'll get back in touch with you guys once we reach Hawthorne, Nevada at our next supercharging station. I wanna know what it is Quick is trying to say. What is up, y'all? We are lively than we are than we were before. Because when we first started riding, it was four o'clock in the morning, as y'all already know. So now that we got some sun, we're able to stretch a little bit. Bliss Ann's back there charging. She's only supposed to charge for 20 minutes before we start our, our journey back up. And we got some snow on the ground or ice. So, we're just gonna walk, walk across the street to stretch our legs a little bit. And we're gonna, you just grabbing snacks? So yeah, we're just gonna walk across the street, stretch our legs and grab some snacks maybe. Oh, and the town we're in right now is called Tonopa, Tonopa, Nevada. I don't know how you pronounce it, but. That's where we are. How are you enjoying the ride so far? 
two thumbs up for me. Two thumbs up? Yeah. Anything you change? Better sandwiches. Better sandwiches? Less mayonnaise. Less mayonnaise? Y'all, he front, he actually likes mayonnaise. But. We're literally in the middle of, I guess this town is called Hawthorne, Nevada. Again, it looks like it's in the middle of nowhere and there's not that much to see. But, it's got Tesla chargers and that's all we care about. So, this stop is going to be for 30 minutes. Unless, we decide that we want to um, charge for longer. So, we're going to stay here, stretch our legs again. And then we'll, I think it said that we'd be there in an hour and a half. It is nice. That all about it. And it's nice. Stop. I'm going to get you on the camera. That is nice. Yeah. Like, get the drive actually doesn't, it doesn't feel like we've been moving for four, five, six hours. Exactly. So. That's going to be nice. What time do we check into the hotel? Check-in starts at three. So y'all, I'm extra. I don't know if y'all can see my phone screen, but in my notes section, I made a whole list of things for us to do, separated by the day. So, <laughs> babe, do you wish you could sing like me? I can sing better. See? See? Okay. They gotta clean the rooms and stuff. Thank you for calling. Yeah, that's no problem. Thank you so much. I'll be right back. All right, thank you. Thanks, dear. So she's gonna check with the uh, housekeepers. Gaming and port subs at a, at select locations. Golden Gate Petroleum. Death available. Yes, I'm still here. Hello? Oh, perfect. Thank you so much for holding. I totally appreciate it. I will just double check in, and you're more than welcome to check in by one. The room is going to be available. Perfect. Um, I don't want to remember. Please stand in line while I turn for you now. There may be a brief moment of silence. All right, thank you. <laughs> ah. So that's good news. That's perfect. Go to the hotel, drop all the shit off. Linger for a while if we want. Nope. Good shit. 
a weary bone. Good shit. Get the Hell yeah. Cause this will be, we're good. All right, y'all, we've been rambling long enough. We'll just get back in touch with y'all once we arrive at our hotel to drop our stuff off. Go, hey, 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 hey. What's wrong with us? Don't need nothing from the Dollar General? You don't need no toiletries or nothing. Nope. No music. No music, no music, no music. Man. Get that hand sanitizer, please. Like man, goddamn. That sounds too dry. You might need a couple more squirts. <laughs> You're funny. I'm being serious. Dry ass hand. Oh yeah, to say that it's 50 degrees. How long did it say? It's supposed to be like 10 minutes. 10 minutes. So what's up to you? Did you want to get there, get to the hotel as soon as possible and supercharge later? Or we can- Let's fill up the 80. Fill up. Mm -hmm. Get the 80, that way we can just get to the hotel, relax a little bit, and then we don't gotta worry about finding one right off the bat. This is my first time experiencing snow. Babe, can you do the honors? Look at that ass. So snow is just ice. What you mean? This is shit that they push to the side. It's on the ground and shit. You gotta find you some clean snow. What? Some clean snow. Yeah, you see it right there? Yeah, let me get some of that. I like it. I like that, huh? You're not about to throw it in my car, right? Okay. Let's just do a 360 really fast. Where did it say we are? Oh, Topaz Lake, Topaz Lodge or something. Look how huge those hills are. Look how cute Look my how husband is. is. 305? Hmm. So why does it say that plus is 223? And there's badass Bliss Ann right there. Getting their charge on. Mm. So, apparently we only gotta stop here for 10 minutes and then we are on the road again. Or, all right, give me a second. Then we're on the road again. I think, what did it say, 40 more minutes or an hour? So, we're doing pretty good. Neither of us is hungry because we have a plethora of snacks. A plethora. Good morning, you guys. It is currently 8.30, 8.45. And uh, we're about to go and find something to eat for breakfast. We are dressed, we are ready to start our day. Um, what's on the agenda is for us to hopefully go to Heavenly Village 
and ride the gondola ride. And we also wanted to do some gambling down at Hard Rock or Harrah's. And we are trying to go to Emerald Bay, I think that's what it's called, Lake or whatever. Because we didn't get a chance to go yesterday because we traveled for eight hours and we were extremely tired and we didn't feel like it. So, we will take y'all through our day. We will post a whole bunch of pictures. And we will shoot a lot of footage. So, baby, you want to say good morning to the vlog? What it is, man. Mm. Okay. Um, so, yeah. We will get back with y'all then. How much of these helicopter tours? Stop by. Well, you got one already, right? What? So we can call them. One of these? That's no, the helicopter one. stool uh, thing. Helicopter stool. You want to come over real quick? What? We didn't even ditch you. Still. Damn! You got your foot all the way out there for This could be part of the thumbnail. Okay. <laughs> We're good. Doctor, usual, that's all you need. Ooh, child. Yeah, and I guess it melted all the ice off. That's perfect. By me heating the car up. Look at all this snow. And I was told. All right. Ooh, feel good in here. I know that, though. He talking about it ain't cold. Okay. <laughs> okay. Even the hand sanitizer warm. I put hand sanitizer. Did you touch the doorknob? No, I didn't touch the shit. Okay. Crystal is nasty. Yeah. Let's still go put some on. Yeah. Alrighty. I want to know what it is quick is trying to say. Cold. I'm gonna give y'all a 360. Babe, smile. It's gonna be another thumbnail. Okay. Don't fall. Be careful.
So, God damn, is it strong? Hey, hell yeah. Did it taste good with gum? You're driving. And it's a sip. No. Now you finna sue me. Next time you, you, you come back out here, I'm out of here. Oh, are you chilly? Huh? Somebody cold? It was a little chilly. Here, you want some glove gloves? I'm just gonna go in right now. Here's some, they're warm. So. Good God. Show y'all this big ass pine cone. Thumbnail. Exactly. This is huge. That is a pretty big pine cone. I saw it laid on the ground. I was oh, like, this is not. ginormous. Uh, it wasn't connected. Propane. Strickland propane. Strickland propane. These shits are warm as hell. What I will I guess do. We don't need gloves. Hmm? Damn, small ass gloves. You want to switch? Because nah, nah, these, these got fleece in them. What are these? They warm? Hell yeah. Good. Oh yeah, I use these tomorrow when we go snowboarding. Good. I say all in all. Hmm? Pretty good uh, trip thus far. Hell yeah, I'm. Thoroughly enjoying my Did uh, some traveling. Going to do some more traveling today. Might go do putt putt. If you want to do that still. I'm down. If they're open. Not if they're open. But yeah, if they're open. And if there's not too much snow covering there. Do some putt putt. Eat. We can eat right here. Go do putt putt. That'll probably be it for the day. Yeah. gondola ride and we are about to well I am about to ski and Mark is about to snowboard so it's literally right across the street right there the gondola I don't know if y'all can see it from here but it's way up there Ooh, it does. Ooh. Mm. Oh, that, looks, that looks like it may be it. Yeah, it does. Welcome to Heavenly. Guest services season passes. Yeah. That should be it. So right now, we're about to go and grab something to eat first. We didn't show you guys this, but we just went to go check in for our gondola ride. And we also went to go and get on the queue. Isn't that dope? I'll show y'all how the gondola looks. I know, I didn't expect for it to go that fast. Mm -hmm. But we just got inputted for a queue for the um, rental equipment too, so we're waiting on that as well. Uh, you drink one oh, I'm full. Oh, all right. And I got snacks. Oh wow. I just don't need this shit to break. We're not even gonna talk like that while we're inside of it. No, we're not. 
Dear God, I pray that we have safe travels on this, oh my God, on this gondola ride. Ooh, this bitch going up. Is she pretty? She is. I want to sit right there, but I don't want to get up and move. Might start rocking. Oh my. <sighs> All these layers will definitely come in handy once we get up there. Cause I'm hot right now. Start falling in the snow and shit. You are gonna get even more hot when we're actually moving this shit. You think so? Absolutely. Hmm. Do you see how high up that shit is? Damn. Yeah. Go all the way at the top of that bitch. Gonna be worth every penny though. Look at all the snow. They can do it. Yeah. Damn it, we can too. Oh shit. I'm hot as hell. We on the ski lift, y'all. Marcus is betting that he's about to bust his ass. Oh, I'm, I'm betting that I'm gonna bust mine. It's gonna be alright for me. Oh god. I'm gonna be looking like that right there. Where? In the snow. On the <laughs> he probably doing it on purpose. purpose. Us, it's gonna be by accident. Marcus is over there struggling because he chose to snowboard. Got a mound of snow on his ass. And you're cracking things. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. some footage mid ski I don't know if y'all see Marcus struggling to get up up there but I'm way down here he's way up there the weather feels fantastic I got on three layers four actually two tank tops sweatshirt and this big puffy green jacket and I got on these baggy ass snow pants they only had 3x so three exits <clears throat> after this we're gonna go to Reno probably shower and everything because I'm still a little sweaty and then we'll get more footage probably we'll spawn the gondola <clears throat> those are the ski lifts up there and that allows us to ski down here Join myself. I feel like Marcus is trying to grab my ski pole. So, 
before I roll down the hill. <laughs> Let me zoom in. It's windy out. Did it hurt? Good. All right, y'all. We'll get more footage once we are. Oh, let me zoom back out. Good God. Y'all see every pore in my face. But we'll get more footage. I'm coming. <laughs> y'all see Marcus <clears throat> with the white pants on? He finally came down. Uh oh. I'm sucky sucky now. Okay. All right. Yes. Yep. Whew. How you feel? Whew, that shit was exhausting. Don't you know? That shit was good as fuck. <clears throat> Whew, Look how high up they go. We didn't go all the way up here, though. Oh, goodness. Yes, we did. We didn't go all the way up here. That's the ski lift. Ain't it? Because where's the ski lift stop? Yeah, that's the ski lift. Ain't no way we went all the way up there. I feel like we did. <laughs> we did. But, because that ski lift. They go up kind of high. Yeah. Oh, so, shit. That was insane. Turning this damn gear. Start the long drive on the Ringo. Hopefully a bunch of the ice is melted now. What you mean, on the roads? Yeah. Should be. All this sun and stuff, but I don't know. I fell when it was time to go back on the gondola. Marcus, how many times you fell? At least 106. 106? Sounds about right. Oh, shit. So, what we're doing now, we're riding the gondola back down to Heavenly Village. Then we're gonna turn in our gear and then I want to shower. I'm sweaty and disgusted. Yeah, I want to shower too. Yeah. And then we'll ride out to Reno, do a couple of things. They got casinos down there too, by the way. And then we'll head back up. It's only like a 45 minute drive. Oh, look at that view over there. I didn't even catch that one on the way. It's too pretty. If the gondola is blocking it, but it's pretty. Damn. Oh, this looks like a big drop. Oh my God. Look, turn around. We'll catch up with y'all once we get back down to Heavenly Village and once we're done with the gondola ride. This lighting is fantastic. So we are on our way to Reno, Nevada. We're about 22 minutes out, 18 miles away. We'll be there um, at 3.37. So, we got a couple of things planned while we're up there. It's a small town, so we don't have a whole bunch of stuff to do. Um, and we'll just let y'all know the different activities. We're definitely going to Brothers Barbecue, great reviews. And um, we'll let y'all know when we go there because that's our first stop. This shit looks delicious. Yes, This is Brothers Barbecue in Reno, Nevada. And this shit came out within three seconds. Look. How is it? So far. All right, y'all. So we just arrived at the Supercharger in Reno, and it is located right beside this El Dorado Hotel, whatever it is, and casino. <clears throat> so we're just gonna go inside, walk around town a little bit, gamble, and then we'll just wait till dark to make sure that we can see the Reno sign in Reno when it's dark outside. Ooh, this light. I like that. Babe, how was dinner? I mean, yeah, dinner. Like I was saying, we ate at Brothers Barbecue. That shit was indeed delicious. Well, we're going in the casino, so I gotta put this off. They don't usually allow recording, so catch up with y'all later. Okay. <laughs> Thanks. Thanks, Bubby. You're so sweet. Going into another casino. Gotta cut y'all off. In 500 feet, turn right.
right onto Maple Street. Don't tell me what to do, okay? Now turn right onto Maple Street. Look at him getting our little hot chocolate. Thank you. Got way more visibility. I like that. I like that. <laughs> this could be a slow motion. You ain't even do no damn. Hey, what's going on, guys? We're on our way home. All right, put the camera on me then. Can you back the camera? <laughs> what is up, guys? We were scheduled to go to Sacramento, California. Can you make sure I'm getting a good view? You all, yeah, I got you. Cause that picture you uploaded on Instagram, I didn't like my edge. I oh, well, like I can, that. I can delete it. Can you upload another one? I'll delete it. And How upload that? another. That's the one I like, so that's the one I upload okay. on my page. Anywho, guys. So, we were scheduled to go to Sacramento, California today, but we opted out because of this weather right here. So, it was way worse. Right now, the roads are just a little slick. They don't have any snow on them as we are going snap, uh, more south in Nevada rather than going to California. So, we're on our way home. Sadly, we are on our way home. We have ended our trip. Oh, I just got a text message from Goodwill. They got a President's Day sale. How about you focus on the road? So pretty much, um, we're on our way home. We're scheduled to be there in seven hours, 57 minutes, so eight hours. Um, it was a very nice trip. <clears throat> I enjoyed myself, especially watching Marcus fall 46, 47 times. That was pretty nice. Um, and I didn't fall at all. So, oh shit, I'm not recording. Yes, you are. Yeah, I am. I just like to make jokes. But anywho, so our first stop will be in Hawthorne. Pretty much we're going to be making the same exact stops that we made on the way up here. So y'all saw how we had to stop in Betty, Beatty, Tonopah, and Hawthorne. So now we're just going to be doing those same stops but in reverse. So we're going to be going to Hawthorne. We'll be there in... Um, Looks like two hours. And uh, yeah, we're just gonna get some B-roll for y'all right now. Broke my damn lens. Heavy handed. Bad handed ass. My hands like heavy. My hands are slow. No, see, you can make all these jokes and make fun of me, but the second I do it to you, you wanna get all of your damn feelings. Was that an insult? Were you offended? Charlene, you said I have hands like AB. Shut the f he has see? big man hands. I almost did it. He has large Tell man hands. That is not what you meant by that. So All don't right. so don't do that. Do you think you have hands like AB? It doesn't matter what I think. Oh my. So, like I stated earlier, we ended up leaving Lake Tahoe early. With that. We are now in Beatty, Betty. That was our very first stop to supercharge on the way to Lake Tahoe. And um, funny story. I thought I submitted an assignment, which I know I did, um, before I left because I wanted to get my stuff done out of the way. I wanted to get it early, get it pretty much submitted early. Um, so while we're in Lake Tahoe, I go to check to make to see if it's been graded yet. And I see that nothing has been submitted. I'm devastated. I email my teacher to see if there's a way that we could get it, um, or if I could get it submitted once I get back, which was supposed to be tomorrow, the 14th. She said she sent me an email. My work email 
is on my work computer and I didn't have access to it. So I said all that to say on the way home, we're going to drop by work. We're going to grab my work laptop. I'm going to check my email. I'm going to see what her email says. Um, because I didn't email my teacher. I sent her a question or I inquired about this and I told her about my issue in the ask the professor section and she said she sent me an email so I'm gonna check my email I'm gonna see what she said and I'm just gonna submit the document because all in all it's a blessing in disguise that we left home or we left early because it is due today by 9 p.m. Pacific Standard Time 12 p.m. Eastern Standard Time so long story short the assignment won't be late thank God and I'll be able to get my points fun stuff very very fun stuff yeah we'll catch up with y'all when we are at home